morning everybody it is saturday the 29th of september it's 26 minutes past 11 in the morning which means mother-in-law is 56 minutes late um yes she was supposed to be here at half past 10. we have cleaned the house we've gone out and bought her a cake and candles and stuff and we're back in time and I've drank a pint of tea. Still not here. So I'm crocheting. I finished my granddad's blanket. It needs to go in the wash. It's I've moved it out of here because obviously we're expecting guests. Um, but I'll show that to you later, hopefully. Um, so I've started making hexagons for the giraffe uh, that I've been asked to make. It's Jedi the Curious Giraffe by Heidi Bears. I'll link the pattern below. I've made three now. Yeah, I think three. Um, so I'm making another one because Paul's aunt has asked me to make one for her friend for Christmas. So I'm getting a start on that now. Um, yeah. I'm coughing quite a lot at the minute. So my throat is, it's not particularly sore, but it's sounding <clears throat> a little bit rough. Uh, it seems to have affected my asthma, these germs. So I'm coughing a lot and wheezing. Um, but other than that, I feel fine. I had a bit of a headache earlier. I took some tablets. It's It feels fine. So, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> yes, yeah, so today I've got to try and squeeze in doing the ironing. Um, because, for all I know, we could be out all day tomorrow. I did the shopping last night. Um, yeah. So I will catch up with you in a little bit, tell you what's happened with the rest of the day, but I thought I'd just give you a, here's our morning, and I've got a few minutes while Paul's out of the room, don't know where he's gone, um, but yeah, just thought I'd pop on and say hello, so um, I'll be back with more later, bye guys. Hi everybody, it's now 25 to 5 in the afternoon, I've just set up the ironing, because um, in the end, Paul's mum was an hour and a quarter late, so that was fun. Um, she, well, they left about two o'clock, and then we went to see Paul's sister because she was going to come over, but Paul's mum was here at the time, so um, she didn't want to sort of get in the way or anything. So we went over to their house and um, got to see Felicity, my other niece. Um, which was nice. Uh, gosh, she's got so big since I saw her last. Flies. She'll be two in November. I can't believe that. Um, yep, so I had a cup of tea over there and um, nice chat, so that was good, but we've just got back, so I've got to do the ironing now because, in theory, we're going to be busy all day tomorrow, so I probably won't have a chance. Why are all these shirts inside out? Um, Oh yeah, found one that's not. Um, so yes, I'm going to get on with that. I have uh, start. I've got all the centres for the hexagons I need for the African flower giraffe. I've done most of the second rounds, second and third. Um, I was doing them in the car on the way to Paul's sisters, and while we're waiting for mother-in-law to turn up this morning, so um, that should come together quite quickly, uh, really. Let me find Grandad's blanket. One second. Here it is. Excuse the mess. Just mess. That's the. That's all that's there. Uh, school jumpers on the back of the chair. So, see if I can hold it up enough. Grandad's blanket. Uh, I have no measurements. Ooh, I don't know. Um, but it's it's definitely a good lap size. I don't he won't put it on his bed, but he can have it over him on the chair uh, on his on his chair. So it's that width depth. I don't know. That's the width, I suppose, and then that's the length. Let's see from the floor. To me, it's probably what four and a half, four foot eight, something like that. Um, so yeah, it's a good size. It's I used all seven balls, so 700 grams of uh, wool acrylic for the last round. I, I ran out. Uh, where is it here? If you were able to see, but I did single crochet um, 
three single crochets in each that's the chain three that you do um, instead of double crochets so I did single crochets and had to change to the black cone of mystery but it was only for a side a side and a bit side and a quarter maybe so I thought I'd go with that Let's see how um, apologies if the lion uh, the lion I've got a lion the iron is too loud um, but yeah so grandpa's blankets done I'll get it washed Sorry, very distracted today, aren't I? Um, yeah, my white trousers. Um, so yes, uh, I'm just going to crack on with this. Um, I just want to say um, big woolly hugs to Mel, Mel Hall. Hi Mel. Uh, I watched your latest video. And I'm sorry to hear that you you know you're having a hard time with it. But we're all here for you. So big hugs and we're thinking of you and just take it a day at a time and be kind to yourself please um, who was going to give a shout out to Lisa Lisa? yeah Lisa Fenton Hi. Um, I know you've not been feeling great at the minute as well and Christina hi Christina, Criticid12 um, I see your mum's in hospital that's scary stuff uh, I hope uh, Cameron's doing okay and all your animals and your daughter of course and your hubby, everyone, everyone. Um, but yeah, I think everyone just needs lots of big woolly hugs as Anne says. And, um, yeah, it just seems to be a bit of a hard time at the minute so I'm sending big hugs to everybody and um, yes, let's hope yarn fairies are kind to us. <laughs> um, but yeah, so take care everyone. Uh, I'm going to go now and crack on with this because the sooner I get going properly, in theory, the sooner I'll get it done. And then there'll be more ironing, just magically appear. But if we've at least all got work clothes and uniform, that's a good start. So, sorry, there's not a great deal of crochet again. But I finished a blanket, so yay. Um, and I'll be back tomorrow. It may just be a montage video, I don't know, but obviously we're up and out with Tobes. We've had birthday cake today with Sam today because we're probably not going to get a chance tomorrow he's had quite a few presents today but there'll be more to come tomorrow uh, he's got quite a lot of money to spend already lucky so and so uh, but yeah so take care and I'll catch up with you tomorrow bye guys <laughs>